A civil rights group in Nigeria known as the Child's Rights Advocacy Network has described the Nigerian child as an endangered species due to the myriad of threats he faces to survive, which includes poverty, malnutrition, and lack of access to quality education and healthcare abuse, exploitation, and neglect. We're trying to protect the rights of priv to privacy of those children, not Yahabelo. Yahabelo is an adult. If he commits a crime, he should be called to, to, to answer for his crime. But children, I, I, we, I, we will do anything. Any other place, any other time, these children are being mentioned in respect to this Yahabelo's matter. We will take to the streets and we are calling on Mr. President to look into this matter and should stop looking the other way. These children will grow tomorrow. So when they grow tomorrow, what would they say? That they were in primary school, they were being, they were being a, a, a kind of, a, you know, stigmatized. They, they, they have been bullied just in the media. Because when you say, yeah, yeah, but, oh, people will say, oh, your father, you, you were those ones that were in school when your father stole so, so amount of, when your father was accused of stolen so, so amount of money. So he's not going to occur well. They are going to be traumatized and stigmatized in future, right from now. So we are calling on the federal government to see what they're going to do. They should redirect the mindset of the uh, uh, EFCC, Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, to be able to focus their attention on the, on the, on the meat, the real meat of the matter. To this end, the group is condemning the action of the EFCC and the American International School for dragging the children of the embattled former governor of Kogi State, Yahaya Bello, who was supposed to be protected by the Child's Rights Act and the ongoing financial imbroglio and seize all actions against Yahaya Bello's children. We are condemning such acts and we call on uh, Mr. President to wade into this uh, unwarranted um, abuse of these children's privacy. And we want to, as a, as a civil society organization, let you also know that the children of Yayabelo are entitled to their privacy. And anything that would make them not enjoy their privacy as enshrined in the Constitution will never be tolerated. We call on uh, NAPTI and other uh, civ uh, uh, human rights commission and other concerned and uh, entitled agencies to come to the rescue of these children. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.